I feel like I have a really good sense of the house. And I have to say, it has a good soul. Okay, tell me, what would be your price? My price? Yes. Well, all the furniture stays. It stays. Two acres, Beverly Park, that view, me as a broker, ding, between 26.5 and 28.5. And also, I've seen a lot of the photos and the aerials, but I wanna come back and I really wanna see the garden. I don't know what your thoughts are on timing here, and I'm giving you a range. We'll definitely talk about it. Talk about what? About the price and about timeline. We could talk now. Okay. 28.5. So at the very higher range, of upper course, range of my of course, range. Of course. So 28.5, I can agree as a listing price, and I will work tirelessly to get very closer at that number. I did some background checks on you, some researches. Uh, you're number one in New York. Yes, I'm I want number you one in New York. New York clientele to take a look at this house. Yes. And? And Josh Altman is number one in LA. Oh, God. At this price range, I want him to sell the house to his clientele. You know Josh, right? Uh, I know Josh, yeah. Yes. The perfect 50 50. I don't see him as competition. Of course I'm gonna win this competition. I mean, you be the judge. Do you like, whoa, 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 whoa? Or do you like, wee, wee, wee? I'll go first and then he'll go. What's up everybody? Welcome back to another walkthrough of an insane house on Josh Altman's YouTube channel. We're here right now in Beverly Park. Are you guys ready to see one of the sickest houses you've ever seen? $28,995,000, let's go! So Frederick, let's have you take the living room with your style and then Josh will have the billiard room. You have six bedrooms and 11 bathrooms because 10 is never enough. And I just feel like so at home when I'm here. And isn't that what a home is supposed to do? Just relax, watch some TV. Your family is here. The kids are running around. Look. Hello? You like me? You like Josh? He likes me more. Any house really starts with the family, right? And personal experiences, I made it a really big deal that me, my husband, my kids, we eat together every single night. Enjoy life. You made it in life. That's why you're buying in Beverly Park. You're here because you deserve it with your family. Okay. Yeah. Uh, well, who's ever still awake at this point? Uh... <laughs> Dinner is served in your new mansion in Beverly Park. Check this out. First of all, the ceiling, gold. Gold everything. You deserve a gold ceiling when you have a house like this. And this table, yeah, that's right. You can fit up to 20 of your crew, your boys. Crew? You're hanging out, Ooh. you're drinking, you're having a blast in your dining room for your entire crew. And that is what this is all about. Because when you have a house like this, you know you got an entourage. <laughs> Are you interested in the house or in the land? Uh, my clients have been looking for land in this neighborhood for a really long time, but okay. the house seems kind of interesting. So while we're here, I think might as well see both. Yeah. When was this built? 1956. Okay. Some people like the mid-century look of it. I really love old homes, so I hate to say this, but I'm not somebody who will say preserve it if it's ugly. Totally. We have our living room. That's what's I see what you're salvageable. Saying. Look, this design was great in the 1950s. You have the lava rock fireplace, you've got the plants going in the entryway, but homes like this are not appealing to buyers in today's market. This house has a tiny kitchen, low ceilings, and an awkward floor plan. You've got a lot of things that people thought were really cool back then. Today, not so much. And then this is the main bedroom. Oh, I, I see you cleaned up for me, Josh. Oh, hold on, let me get my vacuum out of my rolls. 